Hello, we are the senior design team sponsored by Eaton. Our project was focused on characterizing high pressure aluminum die castings, specifically the skin and core regions. In high pressure die casting, molten aluminum is injected into a cooled mold. This allows intricate near net shaped parts to be manufactured cheaply and quickly. In current modeling of high pressure die cast parts, bulk material properties are used. However, the structure is more like a composite and should be modeled as such. Due to rapid solidification, the skin layer has a fine microstructure and is believed to have superior mechanical properties. The core region has an inhomogeneous microstructure and ought to contain significant porosity. The updated modeling of the system will improve designs and reduce costs associated with testing and manufacturing of new products. Further characterization of the skin core effect is necessary for improvement in high pressure die cast manufacturing. Nano indentation is a superior testing method for mechanical properties on submicron length scales. This is because hardness can be determined from a load displacement curve rather than optically measuring the indentation. Nano indentation allows surfaces to be mapped with good resolution, and thus a model describing hardness as a function of distance from the free surface can be developed, providing insight into skin and core formation and properties. Our samples were prepared from tensile bar grips prior to tensile testing, and two types of tests were performed. The long test involved deep indents testing a mixture of phases, and the high speed test shown on the right involved shallow indents that tested a single phase. The table shows a statistical difference in skin and core for A383, but not the ASCAS or heat treated parts. Hardness measurements varied greatly due to the presence of different phases shown on the right. Smaller indents showed more variance due to measuring separate phases, as opposed to larger indents that took a mixture of many. A continuous distribution function, or CDF, displays the data for visual identification of the mean values and outliers. The example CDF on the left depicts data from three aluminum alloys. However, this analysis can be used to distinguish between phases present in the skin and core of high pressure die cast parts, such as primary aluminum and silicon aluminum. The CDF on the right is the results from the heat treated test. The overlapping curves demonstrate that there is no statistical difference between the skin and core arrays. This approach improves the understanding of what causes the skin core effect. We concluded that a high speed testing methodology and analysis was developed to accurately map the sample's cross section. The skin effect was observed visually from the microstructure of the samples through optical and SEM metallography. However, no significant difference in the mechanical properties was determined between the skin and core. A special thanks to Dr. Eric Herbert for helping with the nano indentation. Thanks to Michigan Technological University for allowing us to use their facilities and the assistance of its faculty members. And finally, thank you to Eaton for sponsoring this project and supplying the materials for this study.